Hey, what's up, everybody? Sir Cardinal back with another video. I broke this trade during my live stream tonight, ladies and gentlemen, but I need to make a separate upload and dissect this trade even further. And without further ado, I got to do it. Warriors, come out and play. The Brooklyn Nets have agreed to sign and trade D'Angelo Russell to the Golden State Warriors. In exchange, the Warriors needed to shed some salary, and they found a trade partner with the Memphis Grizzlies, and the Memphis Grizzlies are getting Andre Iguodala. But this is where it gets tricky. There's reports now saying that the Warriors are also receiving Trevion Graham and guard Shabazz Napier to go along with D'Angelo Russell to the Golden State Warriors. Memphis... Like I said, are getting Andre Iguodala, but there's draft picks involved. I don't know if Brooklyn's getting any of these picks or if just Memphis is getting them, but there is a 2024 protected first round pick. Also, that's within the ranges of one to four, a 2025 protected first round pick and a 2026 unprotected pick. Who knows what pick that is? If it's a first round, second round, it doesn't matter, but I don't know if Brooklyn's getting any of these picks. I think they would be, but it's just all out there right now that all these picks are going someplace, but the but the big winners are this are the Golden State Warriors, ladies and gentlemen. And they're also getting Trevion Graham and Shabazz Napier. So that's a pretty big get for the Golden State Warriors. I love this pickup, ladies and gentlemen, for the Golden State Warriors. They're getting a very young player in D'Angelo Russell, 23 years old, already a seasoned vet. He's been in the league for a few years. He has He's played with Kobe Bryant, went to Brooklyn, had an all-star season, averaged 21 points a game, seven, re or seven assists, and was an absolute stud this past season. And now he is joining forces with Klay Thompson, Steph Curry, and Draymond Green. This is going to be an exciting season. And once Klay Thompson returns from injury, this team, if they're in a playoff spot, which most likely they will be, ladies and gentlemen, I think these Warriors are going to be still very good. They could upset one of the top teams in the Western Conference in the up-and-coming season. And then in the future, these guys could be neck-and-neck neck with the Lakers for the top seed in the West again. I love this pickup for the Golden State Warriors and their fan base. You guys have got some talent. And I am excited for you guys and see what you guys do. I can't wait to call the first game of the Golden State Warriors in the new season and just to see what D'Lo does. They're, they're going to be a scary team. They're going to be a fast-paced team. And D'Angelo Russell is going to be an absolute stud for the Golden State Warriors. But like always, guys, I'd like to hear your comments on this trade. What do you think? How do you feel about D'Lo joining the Golden State Warriors? If you guys are happy, let me know in the comment section. If you guys are upset with this deal, if you're another fan base like the Brooklyn Nets or another team that wants wanted him like the lakers were rumored for days that he was going to the lakers let me know in the comment section i always like reading your guys' stuff and like always guys leave a like those always do wonders on the channel so thank you guys for watching this video and i'll see you guys in another video really really soon you guys have a great night it is canada day and it's going to be a party up here in canada today so i'm looking forward to enjoying some fireworks later on tonight and i'll see you guys really really soon cardinal out Boom. Peace out. Let's go, warriors.